Hey, Jeff here from Deep Sickle Battery. Today I wanted to come back and revisit a installation we did. This is the uh, 12 volt, 460 amp hour Epoch lithium iron phosphate battery. And we have a diesel pusher motor home. You can see that the battery tray used to, where it was big enough, it accommodated six, I'm sorry, eight six volt golf cart flooded lead acid batteries. And we were able to put two of the Epochs in parallel in this tray and really nice the form factor the elongated narrow design allows it to sit in the tray and then this is the epoch rail mounting accessory that you can buy as an option i really recommend using that it made mounting this battery real simple and uh i'm, I'm up here just checking on the batteries i'm putting in a uh, mrbf fuse into the positive of this terminal on the positive cable here just because i want to do that and the batteries are getting are in parallel so we have negative negative going to a negative bus and two positives going to a positive bus bar uh, i believe these are blue c 350 amp rated uh, bus bars and then the coach lands the the dc from the coach lands polarity on the positive and on the negative and this model has bluetooth and it beams to your phone but what's really also nice is it does come with little battery soc meters so these guys we just mounted to this uh spot right here cord corresponding to this battery and this one to this battery um, but anyway if you want to see what these look like inside your motorhome uh they do real well and this my customer has been real happy since they moved off of the uh, flooded lead acid batteries uh, again, this is the Epoch 12 volt 460 amp hour mod, model battery. And I asked the Epoch, would I, when would I be using these dip switches? And they said, this is for the uh, Victron uh, interface protocols if you're using Victron equipment. So I don't, haven't explored that yet. Hopefully some of you guys have already done that. Um, but I will tell you, tech support over at Epoch is phenomenal. Uh, really good, knowledgeable people. And uh, yeah. And then, of course, the Epoch has an on-off switch. Highly recommend you have this in the off mode when you uh, in do your installation. Hope that helps you guys. Take care.